Girl, as if we needed anything else from Amazon. Here we are. Hello guys. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing an Amazon haul because who doesn't love Amazon hauls? It was a trick question because absolutely everyone loves them. So let's go ahead and get into the video. I have a variety of things, clothes, jewelry, hair care, but I don't think I need skincare. Random stuff. But anyways, yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. Okay, the first thing I picked up is actually for a pop-up shop that I'm doing. If you don't know, I have a small cosmetic brand called Fawn Beauty. We specialize in lip gloss and we have all sorts of things. We're vegan, cruelty-free, organic oils are the only thing that's used. And we donate 10% of our profits to those in need. But anyways, um, I'm doing a pop-up and I wanted people to be able to like see themselves putting on a lip gloss and like have a place to put the applicators and stuff. So I don't want to blind y'all because like that's definitely going to be blinding if I have all these lights shining on me. But anyway, I got this mirror. Okay, and I'll pop a picture up of the mirror so you guys can see. It does have three settings. I guess I'll just show you and try not to blind you. It does have three settings, you know, so you can tap, 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 tap in. Anyways, it's not like the highest of quality, like it's just plastic, but it's actually a really nice mirror. It's really good quality um, glass and it comes with a charger. So like, yay. I thought that was super nice. And then also for the price, I mean, like, can you beat it? Mm, probably not. It'd be nice just to have, like, on your makeup vanity or to literally do anything with. It's just, an, it's just nice, okay? The next thing that I picked up is um, this. This is the Physician's Formula Glow Face Palette. It's a limited edition palette. Now, the reason I picked this up is because I have the Physician's Formula um, Bronzer Palette that's limited edition, which I have talked about probably, like, three or four times now on my channel. It smells so good. But I use this every single time that I do my makeup. I cannot do my makeup without this now. I actually purchased mine from Walmart. But whenever I was buying um, these other items, it popped up that they have this. And it's like $9.96 or something. So definitely I'll link this down below. Make sure you get this. It's amazing. I talked about it in my um, recent favorites video. So if you want to see like some applications, some swatches, that sort of thing, it will be uh, linked down below as well. But anyway, that's the reason I picked this one up. So this is the um, face palette, the glow face palette. It has a highlighter, a blush, and a bronzer. And so I actually use that today. I think my favorite out of this is probably the highlighter. Um, it actually came and was like, I guess she melts it. She got a little warm and she melts it on the way here. It's like a very... How do, I, how do I describe that? Anyway, it's like a bouncy highlighter. And so it's just like kind of, not liquidy, but kind of moussey. That's what it feels like. It feels kind of moussey. And so I just pressed it back in the pan and it actually seems to be fine. It's what I have on my inner corners today, if you are wondering. Um, the blush is a little bit too glittery for my liking. Um, and I won't be able to use this bronzer until it's like the winter time. Because I'm, I'm, it's just too light for me right now. But overall, it's actually a really beautiful palette. Um, so I'm excited to play around with it a little bit more. And make sure you pick these up, like, soon, though, because they are both limited edition. And if you're going to pick up one, if you have lighter skin, I guess, probably go with this. But if you have medium to darker skin tones, definitely pick this up. You can use them both as eyeshadow, like I did today on the inner corner. They're just convenient. Also, I just feel like they're a really good size. And they're, like, cardboard. I was, like, knocking. Anyway, they're a convenient size. So, like, you can just throw them in your bag. They're not going to bust or break or any of that. And if they do, girl, they was only $10. Okay, next thing I picked up. I actually picked up two more makeup products, which is actually what I'm wearing on my face because before this video, I think I'll have the other one up. Um, I did a testing the top two of the top number one foundation, number one um, mascara selling or sellers. Oh my gosh, why can't I speak? The number one foundation and mascara on Amazon. Okay, so it's the CoverGirl and Olay Simply Ageless um, Foundation and the Essence Lash Princess Mascara. So I'll have that video probably already up and I'll have it linked down below or girl just go ahead and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss none of my videos okay but anyways um I actually really do like this it does have fragrance so that's kind of annoying um I'm gonna see if it irritates my skin um and I'll probably let you guys know in that video but anyways I actually really like this mascara which I know everyone and their mom has raved about literally everyone and their mom um but I'd never tried it really and so I was glad I got to try it today I was glad that I got to try it today even though my left eyelashes have been wilding out for like two weeks now like they just have been so I actually picked up some hair things and two of the things didn't come in yet so I'm just gonna pop it up I'll post pictures of those and probably talk about them in a later video like just trying them on and stuff so I picked up um the Brio Geo Don't Despair Repair Strength and Moisture Leave-In Mask and I picked this up because I was actually re-watching some of Tati's old videos because you know she's resurfaced she's resurfaced praise the lord 
And she talked about this in an actually sponsored video, but I was like, girl, if Tati talks about it, even if it is sponsored, she's being honest, you know? So I picked this up. I love that it's a, a spray, like this kind of spray, not like a spritzer spray, but like this kind of spray. Um, and I love the way that Briogeo smells. I love that it's free of phthalates, parabens, sulfates, uh, silicones, all the things. Like it just has really good ingredients in it. And she was like, if you're going to pick up anything from the line, pick up this. But you, you know I picked up some other things, okay? You know. I also picked this up. This is the Living Proof Restore. <laughs> I also picked this up. This is the Living Proof Restore Perfecting Spray. It says it goes beyond moisture for strength, smoothness, and shine. I have another Amazon package over there. I guess I need to go get that too, don't I? Um, but anyways, I have been looking for um, just looking for products that are gonna like make my hair super shiny and healthy because. The ends of it are super dry. I have really high porosity hair. So I did a hair mask yesterday and it's definitely like shiny and silky and stuff, but it gets really dry towards the ends. And like, that's just not my journey. You know what I mean? I don't want to have tangles. Um, so I'm trying out just a bunch of different things. And these, excuse me, I have the hiccups, are on Prime. So I was like, I'll go ahead and pick those up. And then I actually got a living proof mask, but I left it over here. So I'm gonna go grab it. Okay, so this is the, my hair looks crazy, but I don't care. This is the Living Proof Restore Repair Mask. So this is, I guess, part of the Restore line. So this is the Restore Perfecting Spray, and this is the Restore Repair Mask. Um, they're both really, really good for having, like, good ingredients and nothing bad. So they're silicone-free, no SLS, no SLES, and it's good for... Um, it says it's a powerful silicone-free conditioning treatment that mends dry, damaged hair for long-lasting softness, shine, and smoothness. Color-safe and sulfate-free. So, I'm really excited to try this. And I also like the way that Living Proof things smell. Oh, this has a cat. Never mind. Um, so I'm going to be trying those out. And then this brand actually had really good reviews on Sephora, but they didn't have, like, a trial size. That's a tip that I love is that if you can get on Amazon or you can even find them on Sephora, the trial size of things is, like, such a good idea. I mean, it really is. Sometimes it's not the best value, but at the same time, you kind of are still saving money because it's, like, you're not buying the full thing. You know what I mean? So, whatever. Um, but anyway, this is the brand Mizani. Mizani? Mizani? I would imagine it's Mizani. Um, 25 Miracle Milk. This is the 25 Benefit Leave-In Treatment for All Hair Tops. This is what it looks like. So, like I said, I'm just trying to restore my hair, girl. Like, she needs to get back to a place where she's healthy. So, so that's where we're at. Um, I believe, I think that I did order another hair item, but I'm not positive. And if I did, I will have it linked down below. And then also, I'll put a picture up over here. I feel like I definitely did order another hair item, but it's not going to be here. I don't know. Okay, so now we can move into, um, I have two jewelry items, and then we will do clothes. I love um, Amazon jewelry. It's something that I have worn for years and years. I actually have some Amazon jewelry on right now, which I'll show you guys. This bracelet right here, um, I wear every single day is from Amazon, and it's from the brand Mia Bella. I can have it linked down below for you guys. Um, I wear it in the pool. I wear it in the lake. I wear it in the shower. I wear it, like, literally 24-7. So, and it's 18 karat, I want to say. <sighs> It hasn't tarnished. It lo still looks really, really nice. I've had no issues with it. I love it. So I feel like a lot of the stuff that they have on there is really good quality and you can find it for a really good price. Um, I also love the brand Pavoy, which I know I've spoken on here about before. It is basically just a really affordable brand on Amazon that has, I want to say 12 to 18, maybe like higher carat plated jewelry. So they don't tarnish near as easily or like most of them don't tarnish. All of these earrings that I have in right now are actually Pavoy. So I will try to have those linked down below for you guys. And like I get compliments on my jewelry all the time. And the majority of the time it's Pavoy. Like rarely I have two bracelets that have are like, you know, expensive. But the majority of the time it's like Pavoy stuff. Um so I love buying jewelry off Amazon and just trying different brands. So I tried this brand or I literally just got it in the mail today. This is Allen Coco, um the eco-friendly jewelry company. This is what their little box looks like. And then I got these little earrings, which I absolutely love. My only complaint about these, I, I love earrings that hook like this. The little huggies, I think they're super cute and just like convenient. You don't have to worry about the back falling off or anything like that. Um, So these are the, like the little huggies that I got. I think they're super cute. They are a little heavy though, so I'm kind of concerned. I might wear this for a little bit in my second hole. Move that to my first. I don't really know. I don't really know. We'll see. But then I picked these up too. Where are they at? They're not in here. Okay, I found the earrings. They were laying on my floor. Um, these are from Mev CCO, Mev CCO. I don't know how to pronounce this. But anyways, um, these look 
pretty different than what they look like online. And also they're like not even attached to the card at all. So I want to say these were like 12 or $12 or something like that. And they were supposed to be like a diamond or like a, like a CZ, like a cubic zirconium or a moissanite or something right here, rather than just like a million tiny. I don't know what those are. Um, I don't know if I like those or not. Do you guys like these? I don't know if they're the move. I don't know. Here it is. Close up. It won't stop shaking, but I don't know. I really don't know if I like those or not. I might end up sending those back, but, um, like I said, it's just hit or miss, but I really, really like these. If they weren't so heavy, I would love them. Um, but I'll, I'll wear them maybe like a little bit, um, rather than like every day. These are my everyday earrings because these are very lightweight and I have like kind of stretched out holes, which is really sad for me. Okay, this is another thing that came and does not look anything like the picture. So like I'm suing, you know what I mean? So these are uh, from the brand, I literally don't know what brand these are from, Automet. These look completely different from the picture that was on Amazon. These are supposed to be a dark Kelly green. These are not dark Kelly green. They're nearly see-through. They're not my journey. I'm not messing around with those. I also ordered some tank tops, which I'm excited about. I'm pretty sure I ordered multiple tank tops. I know I ordered the orange one for sure, um, like this. I ordered the small first, and it came in, and she was so small. Girl, she was tiny. So I ordered a medium this time. Because um, even the neck was, like, choking me. I was like, this is not my journey, girl. Like, I didn't my into that. Anyways, so I ordered a medium. It does look a little bit wider, but I'd rather be it too. I'd rather it be too big than too small again. Um, so these are the little crop tops. I just thought they'd be super cute to throw on with sweatshorts or literally denim or, or actually anything, like literally anything. I think they would be cute. cute they'd, they'd be cute with um, leggings, biker shorts, anything. Um, so I picked up that, and then I picked up that in orange too. But like I said, it's not here yet. It's like orange, like my nails orange. Um, so, so hopefully that's cute. And then I picked up this as well, which is pretty much the exact same color. It is the exact same color, same fabric too. But this one has little drawstrings on the side. Um, so I thought that was a nice little touch. So you can just tie it up, scrunch it, you know, the vibes, and then tie it up. Very like 90s Y2K vibes. And then the last thing that I picked up, um, you might hate these, but if you do, I don't care because I really love them. Um, I had a pair of these or I do have a pair of these that my parents actually told me that they look like shower shoes for people in the nursing home. Um, I could see that. I definitely could. They have a valid point. However, they're so comfortable. They're literally the most comfortable shoes, like stupidly comfortable. And I would indeed wear these as shower shoes. So if someday I'm in a nursing home, which I pray to God that I'm not, um, I'll be bringing these bad boys and all the nurses will be like, Shee! and I'll be like, Ee! you know what I mean? But anyways, these are them. And I want to say they were like 20 bucks. Whatever they were, they were worth it. You know what I mean? They were worth it. Um, it says, our vision is to improve your family life to the advanced level. Well, you do, honestly. This is from the brand eQuick. It's a comfortable, comfortable cushioning slipper. And that it is. That it is. It's incredibly lightweight. They look like they would be so heavy. They're not heavy. They're lightweight. They're so comfortable. They could be shower shoes. They literally say that they're great for water, which I guarantee it. And I'm sure they float. So if you're in the river and you lose a shoe, you can go after it. It's not going to sink, you know? So that's nice. It's always a positive. Or, I mean, if you're at the pool or something, that's nice too. Um, this is the color tan milk. I want to say it's like literally called milk. Maybe like oatmeal. I don't really know. Anyways, I'll have these linked down below too. I got these in a size um, 42, 43, which is like a U.S., um, women's 10, 10 and a half, something like that. And I would say that they run true to size. They are banging shoes. All right, banging shoes. I really think that's all I picked up from Amazon. Um, I will have everything linked down below for you guys so you guys can test it out. Make sure to follow back up if you're interested in watching the um, CoverGirl and Lash Princess Essence Mascara video. Um, make sure to subscribe to my channel and watch that video because it should be up already. Other than that, I hope that you guys enjoyed the video. If you need any links to anything, it'll be down in the description box as well as a link so you guys can shop Fawn Beauty. Um, as I mentioned earlier, it's my cosmetic line. Um, other than that, I'm pretty sure that's all, but your girl will be probably placing another order here soon. So if that's something that you guys like or want me to do more Amazon videos, let a girl know. Let a girl know. You know I ain't mad to shop. So, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. Please subscribe and like the video before you leave. Other than that, that is pretty much all. Have a fabulous day.